as a journalist and a black woman, I thought I had seen it all until I covered the sport of curling. Curling has always been a very white sport. I mean, just look at it. So when Gail Jones stepped out on the ice, I knew it would be big. I just didn't know how big. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Oh. When you're a black woman in pro sports, the world does not always give you the space to just focus on your game, especially if they don't understand your sport. Controversy today at the National Curling Championships when Gail Jones appeared to take a knee during the competition. I think a lot of this could have been cleared up if people knew literally anything about curling. This is an outrage. She's on her way to representing the USA and she's taking a knee. It is an insult to America, like when they took the Oscar away from La La Land. I wasn't trying to disrespect the flag. Going to your knee is part of the sport. It's literally how you do it. And technically, my knee didn't touch the ice. I'm just that good. <laughs> Questions? Whether or not her knee touched the ice, we knew what she meant. And people were not shy about showing their support, or lack of it. Trainer! You're a trainer! You said trainer? No, 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 I'm not a trainer. I'm just on the team. I got into curling because of my grandma Esther. She was the first and only black woman in the NCL, the Negro Curling League. She had it rough. White people saw a black woman with a broom and they assumed she was a maid. They would literally come up to her in the middle of a match and hand her their laundry. I mean, I know she was a machine on the ice, but she wasn't a washing machine. Listen, Gail Jones is a black athlete making a statement in this country. So you know what happened next. Kim Jong-un threatened to destroy America today, and President Trump was on it. He immediately fired off a tweet condemning a black athlete. Our president writes, even the blacks agree with me. Trader Gail Jones is an embarrassment. Fire her or I will cancel the Olympics. He can do that. He has that power. And if the Olympics are canceled, it's Gail Jones's fault. Trump's outrage is just the latest example of punishing a black body for daring to venture into territory that is quite literally white. America has no problem watching black people slide backwards. But sliding forwards? You in danger, girl. It's like my grandma Esther used to say, I'm just trying to play the game and y'all keep handing me this mess. Oh, she was probably talking about laundry, but still. When you look at the history of black people protesting in sport, there is always a consequence. It was an impossible situation. And with the weight of the world on her shoulders, Gail tried to find a technique that wouldn't be so controversial. The atmosphere is electric here at the Olympic Curling Trials, where Gail Jones is taking the ice. The clock is ticking, but Jones seems unshaken, clearly reclaiming her time. One knee hits the ice, and then the other knee hits the ice and then her entire body is sliding along the ice. And the people are on their feet. And she's done it. That move is definitely not legal and she will be disqualified, but Gail Jones has brought the people together today. Curling hopeful Gail Jones pulled off a move that somehow satisfied those calling for black justice, those terrified of black justice, and the 20 or 30 people who witnessed it as curling fans. I'm just so happy all my hard work finally paid off. Oh, excuse me, my shoe. Hey, she's taking a knee. Oh, not again.